Hey guys, what up? It's iDestiny. Welcome back. And this is the LA Lifestyle on a budget, giving you skincare, thriftwear, entertainment industry tips and tricks. A little bit of new stuff coming from me, some music. If you guys haven't checked that out, make sure you guys go and subscribe to the channel and check out all the new stuff that I've been talking about lately. But anyways, so this is kind of a part two or an update to my review on using the Rapid Lash um, Eyelash Serum to kind of help grow my lashes out, get them more healthy. So for those of you that have not seen my first initial review, I'm going to go ahead and link that up here for you guys to check out. That way I don't go over too many details in this because this doesn't need to be longer than it needs to be. So um, if you guys want to know kind of my results after using it for three months, um, what I experienced, what I saw, go ahead and check out this video. This is going to be my six month update even though technically this is month eight but um i actually did this video in i want to say early to mid december but somehow it got deleted off my camera i'm not really sure what happened and it kinds of end up being um pretty good timing because i checked my my p.o box the other day and i had just gotten some pr from rapid lash for their new um mascara so I don't know, depending on how I feel about it, I might jump on here and review that for you guys too. So if you guys wanna see that, comment below, let me know. I've used it a few times, but I'm still not sure if I'm gonna review it on this channel. So this is my six month update. After three months, I saw really, really good results. I really liked the results that I was getting. I did have a little bit of itchiness um, upon using the product and um, a little bit of discoloration on my eyelids, just a little bit, but I didn't really have too many issues with that because, hey, it almost makes it look like I kind of have like a little bit of a natural eyeliner going on so it wasn't super super dark just slight discoloration um, right at the base of my lashes where I was applying the serum now six months comes along still kind of same thing um, a little bit of irritation a little bit of itchiness on the eyelids nothing too crazy I noticed as I started kind of using a little less of the product and really kind of making sure I target it towards the base of the eyelashes and not just across my eyelid you know, on the, on the bottom. Um, I noticed less itchiness, which was really good. I noticed slightly less discoloration, but I did notice that my results definitely slowed down. My eyelashes continued to, you know, look healthy, look a little bit more perky, um, you know, shiny, all those things. But I noticed that the growth definitely slowed in comparison to the first three months of me consistently using the product. So, um, I know obviously with eyelash serums, this is something that I've read a lot is that they can, expire pretty quickly you know once you open the tube that um you know you kind of need to make sure that you're getting a new tube kind of regularly to kind of keep the, those results up so this is something that i did not do but this was just something that i noticed that my results did slow down um which I was kind of bummed about because I, I saw some other people and their eyelashes just kind of kept growing and you know got longer and longer and mine kind of plateaued a little bit but it just was still a good kind of uh, practice to just keep applying it because I noticed um, I think I took maybe like a week off or maybe like four or five days I did notice kind of like a reduction in the healthiness I guess of my eyelashes so it's definitely one of those things once you start eyelash serums it's kind of counterproductive to just stop altogether so it's like if you're not seeing the results that you want definitely go and maybe try you know an, another product but you know just kind of keep updated with the serums or some kind of like castor oil or something because you will notice a decline in the health of your lashes if you stop so <laughs> I was like okay I'm gonna keep using you know this serum even though I'm not seeing as big of results as I did the first three months. So that was, I wanna say, my biggest caveat on using the eyelash serum. Um, maybe I just needed a new tube, I'm not really sure, but um, I definitely wanna get a fresh one and see if I can still get those same results and kind of add on to the results that I do have. I noticed that, um, you know, obviously, after that week of me going without, I started using the serum again. But um, I, I noticed kind of the health and vitality, I guess, of my eyelashes started to come back. But I definitely will say that it does kind of slump off a little bit. I don't know if it's just, you know, me biologically or, it, you know, maybe I just needed a fresh tube that I needed to kind of get every other month or something like that or every two to three months. So if you guys were thinking of trying it, I definitely would say to try it just because it's more budget friendly in comparison to some of the other ones on the market. Um, you'll probably notice results. If anything, you'll notice that your eyelashes look a lot healthier and are a little bit more perky. But as far as seeing results, you know, continuously down the line, continuing to grow and grow and grow, I'm not sure if you'll really see that after like maybe the fourth or fifth month which was kind of my experience um, but thank you guys so much for watching um, next on my list is the the four chicks um, eyelash serum so I did try that so I'll be letting you guys know my results 
And um, then if you guys want to see the the mask the mascara serum from Rapid Lash, uh, go ahead and comment below. Let me know. And if there's any other brands that you guys have seen on Instagram that you guys want me to review, comment down below and let me know as well. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Like this video if you want to see more. I'll be posting more as usual and hopefully more consistent from now on. But make sure to do well and be well. And I'll see oh oh and I have a, a new giveaway that is kind of on the way because I'm almost at 4,000 subscribers. I've already hit 500,000 views. So. If you want to get in on that giveaway, I'm going to go ahead and link it below as well. But do well and be well, and I'll see you later. Bye.